Hey guys, Rage Vipers here, and today I'm going to show you how you can log in as administrator in Windows 10. So, in this video, we're going to be unlocking the built in administrator account that's already on Windows 10, and we're also going to be changing its password so we can log into it. So, let's get started. So, you want to come down to the search bar and you want to type CMD. Now, you can either press Ctrl, Shift, and Enter, or you can right click on the command prompt program here and click Run as Administrator. Now it's important that you run as administrator else you'll probably get something like an error 5. If you don't run as administrator then most likely it's not going to work at all unless you've already got administrator privileges on the account that you're using. So you want to click run as administrator and then you want to click yes. Now when it brings up this command terminal with administrator you then want to type net space users. And as you can see, there's the built-in administrator account there. So we know we have it on our computer. So we just did that command to check that it was there. All the commands I do will be in the description. So you can read them from there if you're struggling to read them from the video. Now the next command that we're going to be doing is it's going to be net space user space administrator. And then space forward slash active colon yes. Now, as you can see, it's been successfully completed, so now the administrator account's active. So now we would be able to log into it, but we don't know the password. So we, we do need to change a password for it as well. So to change its password, we're going to type net space user space administrator space and then asterisk and then press enter. Now, when you type in the password, it won't show up. But it has been entered, so I'm going to put 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then I'm going to press enter. And then I'm going to retype it again, so I'm going to put 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and I'm going to press enter. And now we've changed the password of the administrator account as well. So now we don't need the command prompt to open anymore, so I'm going to close it. And now I'm going to sign into the uh, administrator account, now it should be active. Now we're going to put in the password that we changed it to, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then we're going to press enter. Now when you when you first log in, it'll first have to set up like every other account. I've logged in before, so it's already set up. And the only problem with the administrator account is the, the Edge browser doesn't work. So the Microsoft Edge browser doesn't work for some reason with a built-in uh, account, so I'll show you. So if I try and open it up here, it says it doesn't work using the built-in administrator account. So you can just use another browser. So for example, I use Chrome. I'll just show you that it works. Now as you can see, look. Chrome works fine, we'll just give it a quick test. And there you go, it works. So you can I think you can use near enough any other browser apart from Edge. So if you really like using Edge, then maybe don't go on this but this account probably isn't for you. You maybe find another way to do whatever you're trying to do. But as long as you don't mind not being able to use the Edge browser, which doesn't bother me at all because I use Chrome, then you should be fine. So guys, that's going to be the end of the video. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button. And to stay up to date and show your support, don't forget to hit that subscribe button.